come to you live on EA Sports. I'm Ed Cohen. Great to be joined by the pride of Plainfield, New Jersey. He's been running the fast break his entire life. It's Jay Williams. Dissing it left, dissing it right, making the right play at the right time. That's what Plainfield guards do. Let's see what the guards do down on the court tonight. And Jay, we are ready to go. This one about to get underway. Opening tip controlled by the wings as they get in first. We're underway. Storm have it. Knock loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. From in close. Nice finish at the rim. The pass was really good, but what I love most about the play, Ed, was that every player that ran in transition had active hands, which means they were active targets. They provided a target for the player to deliver the pass. That's how you work together as teammates. Knocked loose. Layup chance. And a nice finish at the rim. Two points. Take them any way you can get them. Here comes the screen. Knocked loose. That one's stolen by Dallas. Pick up that sense of urgency. Here's a chance to break the top. Storm have it. It's early. Get a good quality shot here. Catch and shoot. Fires the three. Oh, good offense beating good defense. Just let me break down to all the young players at home how special of a pass this was. That was a perfect delivery, and it hit the player right in the chest. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Has a look. Oh, beautiful feed, but she couldn't finish. Trying to cash in, knocks it down from mid-range. I've known Sue Bird since the high school days, and I cannot believe she still has it. Her accolades are ridiculous. She became the WNBA's all-time leader in games played last season. She also became the first woman in league history to play 500 games. That's pretty incredible that she's still this good. Oh, this is easy. This is easy. Here comes the screen. Now Gray for three, and the rebound pulled in by Stewart. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. Wings have it. Lost it up. Finishing inside the paint on that one. And cutting hard in transition is one of the most underrated things about this game. The harder you can cut is the more it opens up the floor to make plays just like that. The shot here blocked. That's why a rim protector is a necessity in this game. Knocked loose. Storm have it. To the rim. Cruises inside for two. Now their head coach signals for a timeout. They'll regroup before the action continues. Some lineup changes now for both clubs. Knocked loose. Storm have it. Wings have it. Storm have it. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. 
Wings have it. Storm have it. Lost it up and scores. Strong take. Used to hear all these coaches talk about, we need players to run the floor. No, I don't need you to run the floor. I need you to run the floor with purpose. Those are two different things. When you run the floor in attack mode, that's when plays like this occur. And the rebound pulled in by Stewart. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Layup try. Count it. Plays like that remind you why Alicia Gray was the rookie of the year in the WNBA in 2017. You got a deal, guy. Yeah, lots of time. String coming left. Watch well, watch well. Knocked loose. Wings have it. From in close, and scores. Skylar Diggins-Smith, an all-star four of the last five years. We all saw what she did at Notre Dame, leading the Irish to three straight Final Fours. Knocked loose. Wings have it. And that one is out. We have both squads set to make some moves right now. That pass taken away by Seattle. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Layup chance. Easy pad to the rim. Man, that may not have been a gimme, but that layup at the rim definitely chips away at the pride of the defense. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Here comes the screen. Walsh it up. Tough shot and nearly a chance at a three-point play. No foul. And sometimes less is more. Keeping it simple is the best way. Knocked loose. Storm have it. To the rim. And that's rebounded by the Wings. Knocked loose. Storm have it. Lost it up. Count the basket at the rim. I'm telling you right now, with moves like that, scoring is not going to be an issue tonight. Knocked loose. Storm have it. Wings have it. Late heave to beat the buzzer. That's it for the first quarter. The Storm with the lead. One quarter down. Both sides getting a feel for where this game is going. I know you're wondering why I'm clapping. Both teams came out in the first quarter and they executed. When do you ever see that, Ed? You have to continue to bring those competitive juices into the second quarter, and we're going to have one heck of a ball game. And count the basket. Strong finish. That's what you need, regardless of contact, focusing on the rim. Storm have it. Come on, let's dig in. Let's really build this lead. Knocked loose. Storm have it. They've got it now.
Storm have it. That's going to be out of bounds. Time to adjust. Both coaches making changes on the floor. Wings have it. Layup try. Cashes in for two. That's a strong finish. Regardless of contact, finishing strong is key. Oh, where did that come from? I didn't see that one coming at all. Able to convert inside. You feel that? I see the confidence building. Knock loose. And the rebound pulled in by Stewart. Knock loose. Stewart had it. Wings have it. The shot blocked. That kid can block out the sun, Ed. From in close, nice pass to get things going. Great job using that shoulder to create contact with the defender without hesitation. It's good. Old school equals high percentage. Layup chance. She can't get it to go down. And the rebound pulled in by Stewart. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. Has a chance. Short jumper misses. And it's Dallas there to get the rebound. Screen coming. And the rebound taken in by Seattle. Goes to the left side. Driving right to the basket. Walks it up right through the heart of the defense. The layup is good. If you don't know the name Diana Taurasi, you need to. DT tied for third in the league in points per game last year at 20.7 per night. Although she won that title five times and is, in fact, the leading scorer in WNBA history. Both coaches hitting the reset button. Fresh legs coming onto the floor. Knocked loose. Storm have it. To the rim. And the rebound comes to Dallas. Trying to cash in, that's what you've come to expect. Your best players making baskets. Look, I get it. I've been one of the players who have had these mishaps happen to defensively. There is no worse feeling than the next day in film session watching yourself roam on the island by yourself. Somebody in this particular moment needs to tell you to get your head out of you know what to get back in the game. Lost it up and a chance coming up at the line. And as a defender, you cannot, I repeat, you cannot foul in the act of upward motion into your shot. Your timing needs to be better. First one goes down. He's made them both.
has a look. And the rebound pulled in by Stewart. Has a chance. Howard shot misses. Mm, this game is all about the small victories, though. The execution on that play was on point. You keep executing like that, those shots are going in eventually. Knocked loose. Wings have it. That pass taken away by Seattle. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Let's go, defense. Storm have it. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. Wings have it. Storm have it. Layup try, gets to the basket, and scores. The pass was really good, but what I love most about the play, Ed, was that every player that ran in transition had active hands, which means they were active targets. They provided a target for the player to deliver the pass. That's how you work together as teammates. Knocked loose. Storm had it. That one's stolen by Dallas. From in close. Got it. It's not a travel if it looks pretty. Knocked loose. That's it for the first half. The storm around in front. All set to go here in the second half. The third quarter is underway. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Yeah, lots of time. That one's stolen by Dallas. Come on, come on. Show me what you got. Now yeah, a shot nice. rejected. Storm have it. Knocked loose. Wings have it. They've recovered it. That one's going to be out of bounds. Here's an open look for three. Knocks it down. Defender has to get there next time. Ooh, that confidence level is so superior. Whenever you start jogging back on defense before the ball even goes through the net, that speaks for itself. And strokes it. Two points. Take them any way you can get them. Trying to cash in, gets it to go. Didn't have many choices there, lets it fly. Clearly not afraid of the spotlight here because that was not an easy look. Knocks it down, off the step back. No doubt about where that one was headed. Knocked loose, wings have it. Layup chance. 
count it. No and one. There was some contact there. That's what I'm talking about, Ed. It's that simple. Put the ball in the bucket. Knock loose. Storm have it. Wings have it. Lost it up. Layup's good. Those are the types of shots you always strive for. Plays like that remind you why Alicia Gray was the Rookie of the Year in the WNBA in 2017. Knock loose. Wings have it. And that's going to get out of bounds. No turnover as possession stays where it was. Both coaches dipping into their reserves. Changes coming onto the floor. Storm have it. To the rim. Runners good there. I've known Sue Bird since the high school days, and I cannot believe she still has it. Her accolades are ridiculous. She became the WNBA's all-time leader in games played last season. She also became the first woman in league history to play 500 games. That's pretty incredible that she's still this good. No oh, open look. Launches the three. That misses. Shot no good. And the rebound taken in by the Storm. Here comes the screen. The drive right to the basket. Oh, that's out. Out of here. It always looks cool, but guess what? You're still on D. The opposing coach is going to counter. Make some changes of his own. to shoot one of the shot clock hoist a three tough shot well defended and the rebound comes to Johnson lost it up and scores at the basket Jay tough recovery that time Ed, this is like show and tell back in kindergarten. You show the ball, and then you tell him with the easy lay. Going back to the pre-K days, Jay. Knock loose. Storm have it. Layup try. Count the basket. A lot of contact. No foul. There's some players out there that like the freedom of space, and then we have the anomalies. We have the players who feel comfortable being uncomfortable, and almost the physicality of the game centers them and puts them right on balance every time. And the rebound pulled in by the Storm. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. And that's going to get out of bounds. So possession will stay right where it is. New blood coming in for both sides. From in close. Tough shot and nearly a chance at a three-point play. No foul. Hey, one of the things I hear all the great teams say in the huddle, they say one, two, three, no mercy. Now it's time for you to go even harder on the defensive end. Perfect feed to set up the basket. Liz Cambage, the Aussie, the leading scorer in the WNBA last year at 23 points per night. That was an easy one. Here's Stewart. Now for three. Offensive rebound for Seattle. Basket's good on the follow. Way to stay with it. Two points. Take them any way you can get them. Here's the shot. Denied. 
That pass taken away by Seattle. Layup chance. And the finish at the rim. Okay, you don't get a 10 for style points, but it worked. Walsh it up. Count the bucket for two. Big shout out to the athletic trainer for this team. It's obvious you've been doing all the preparation required of your team in the weight room in the offseason. Flex on them a little bit. Knock loose. Storm have it. Wings have it. To the rim. Not going down for her right now. The Wings get it back. Goes reverse to lay it in. Skylar Diggins Smith, an all star four of the last five years. We all saw what she did at Notre Dame, leading the Irish to three straight Final Fours. From the corner, this for three. And the rebound comes to Johnson. Long key from three-quarters court. That ends the third quarter. It's been all storm so far. Wings ball as we start the fourth quarter. And I think the best way to describe where they stand right now is they're down, but they're not out. It's a game we used to play in the league all the time. It's called a series of stops. That means get three stops in a row. Each game is a game within the game. You get three stops in a row, and then another three stops in a row, you're right back in this ball game. Defense making the ball handler work. Knocked loose. Wings have it. That's going to be out of bounds. Shifting gears. Here come some substitutions. Lost it up. A oh, nice pass there, but she couldn't finish. Knocked loose. Storm have it. Wings have it. That pass taken away by Seattle. Tonight, it may not cost you, but in the playoff game, it will. Knocked loose. This one blocked down low. Ed, is it safe to say trust is everything in a relationship, right? So when your guards trust your bigs can enforce the paint, uh, that's a dream, because now I can apply as much pressure as I want. Has a look. And the rebound taken in by Langhorn. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Layup try. Oh, too much contact. Free throws on the way. Great job, Ed, by the shooter to create contact after the jump. That's how you get to the free throw line. First one's up. Count it. She hits the second. Two for two on this trip. Has a chance. Short jumper misses. And Smith has the rebound for Atlanta. Let's 
Storm have it. From in close. Count the basket inside. And cutting heart in transition is one of the most underrated things about this game. The harder you can cut is the more it opens up the floor to make plays just like that. That pass taken away by Seattle. Knocked loose. Layup chance. Converts in the paint. Nice finish at the rim. I love the drive to the basket there. Instead of trying to go around or over, go through. Here comes the screen. Wings have it. Come on, where you at? Where you at? Walsh it up. And the basket good at the rim. You used to hear all these coaches talk about, we need players to run the floor. No, I don't need you to run the floor. I need you to run the floor with purpose. Those are two different things. When you run the floor in attack mode, that's when plays like this occur. Knock loose. Wings have it. That pass taken away by Seattle. Knocked loose. That's going to be out of bounds. Changes coming from both sides right now. Trying to cash in. Offensive rebound by Dallas. To the rim. Yes. And the foul. And a chance at three coming up. Ed, you ever bail out of something at the last second? That's what I saw right there from the defender. We call that no man's land. They weren't really committed to getting out of the way, committing a hard foul, or taking the brunt of the contact. Free throw, good to finish off the three-point play. It's back to a five-point game. Knocked loose. Wings have it. Storm have it. Lost it up. And count the basket inside. The pass was really good, but what I love most about the play, Ed, was that every player that ran in transition had active hands, which means they were active targets. They provided a target for the player to deliver the pass. That's how you work together as teammates. Here comes the screen. Layup try, layup goes down. Well done. I wasn't necessarily sure which way that PNR was going, but I guess neither was the defense. That makes two of us. Knocked loose. Oh, great defense there, forcing the pickup. Storm have it, and that's going to get out of bounds. No turnover as possession stays where it was. Looks like both teams are making substitutions. Knocked loose. And that's going to get out of bounds. It stays with Seattle. Wings have it. From in close, it goes down. Here's lesson number one. When you allow a player like that the freedom of space to dance with the ball, there's no telling what kind of break dance move they might hit you with.
Knocked loose. That pass taken away by Seattle. I tried to work the clock here, but you have to take care of the ball in this possession. And that one is out. Both teams tweaking their lineups. Here come some changes. have it layup chance to the rim lays it up and in Woo! did you see that eyes to the rim and the rest was all net there's the whistle and an intentional foul just their first in the final two minutes so no free throws yet they'll take the ball out of bounds too close to call right now we're in clock management mode that was a good play now an intentional foul. That'll be free throws with 20 seconds left to go. Some players are built to handle these moments. On one end, you just sparked your team. And at the same time, you also got under your opponent's skin. Just want to manage through the emotions here and not take it too far. She knocks down the second. Two for two at the line. Now their head coach signals for a timeout. They'll regroup before the action continues. Just enough of a head fake to help on that one. I'm pretty sure I saw that move earlier in the game. I can't believe he fell for it again. And now they'll get the intentional foul. Free throws coming up with 15 seconds to go. Okay, now look over to the sideline and see what the staff is trying to draw up on the next play. That's good clock management thus far. First one is good. She makes them both. We get a whistle and a timeout as they'll get a minute to regroup and talk things over. Knocked loose. Walsh it up. Now ready for a couple of free throws. Smart play to rip through the extended arm of the defender. That will get you to the free throw line every time. First one, count it. Good free throw shooting. Knocks down a pair. Knocked loose, and that's going to get out of bounds. So possession will stay right where it is. Mm. 
and an intentional foul here in the closing moments, but it shouldn't make too much of a difference in what is now a two-score game. Smart play. You have fouls to use. Good way to manage the clock without burning a timeout. And she connects on the first. And gets both to drop at the line. Late heave to beat the buzzer. 